Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Are you ready to explore the fort? I sure am. So let's go in with Hyper Speed Snivy here and see who's around. I know I already picked, uh, picked you up and brought you here, but I just want to see what else you have to say. Yeah, I mean, you should. Hey, Kogunk. This guy I know you said butt on a feral seat and then started crying. Haha, <laughs> what a dummy. I'm not naming names though. Hmm. Hinting at something, perhaps? What are your wares around here? Let's see. No. Just wanted to see for the heck of it. Uh, let's bash this tree because. For the heck of it. <laughs> now I'm known as the Leafy Gathers. If you are, please battle me. Yes! Yay! This is gonna be fun. Alright, Gibble. Bring it on! I don't really think there's much difference between different Pokemon in this sorts of battle because everyone here has kind of a disadvantage against ye old dragon type here, so uh, I'm just gonna go with Snivy just right off the bat because you know she's super fast, she can easily dodge stuff, and yeah, as you tell, this is done. <laughs> Snivy just makes so, so many things easier. I'm probably gonna end up using her the most. <laughs> the rumors about you are true. I've got to, I have to go tell everyone. The leafy gathers are truly awesome. Gimbal is friended. Sweet. Oh, jeez. I better take it on. <laughs> Where did it, oh, there it is, there it is, there it is. Hey. Hey, how's it going? I was looking forward to the battle tournament in this crag area. I'll be the champion for sure. Unless you think you can beat me, kid. Oh, I can beat you all right. You've got a lot of nerve to say that. Come at me then. All right. Bring it on, big boy. I've got a super fast Snivy on my side. And oh, I actually should wait until you attack, shouldn't I? Whoa! Oh, you attack like that, huh? So you got a, like a split dragon breath attack of sorts. However many, however what kind of move it is, not sure what it is. Maybe it's a dragon rage. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that's my best bet is to wait for you to do that move. Yeah. Jump over it and attack while you are just flopping around there doing nothing. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that works. That works pretty nicely. Obviously, my moves are not all that powerful because you're a dragon type and I'm a grass type, but it means nothing if you can't hit me. <laughs> I think that other move it did when I was in really close was a dragon claw. Probably, or it could have been a slash, something. I don't know, there's something that had to do with sharp nails. Oh, 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 you shot that little high there. I guess I jumped. Oh, 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 okay, Gibble, Gibble, could use your help here. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Actually, I think he shot it at the same angle. It's just that I was on a lower uh, angle to him. That's why it seemed higher than it was. I never would have imagined you'd make me admit the beat defeat. And there we go. A new friend. Uh, hey, hey, you guys. How's it going? Oh no, you're frightened. Tepig is always training near the cannon. Hmm. You don't have anything to do? Like, to be friend? No? Not even if I bump you around a little bit? Well, okay, I'll just look at this cutscene here. Hey, help me! Somebody! It sounds like somebody's inside the cannon. Hmm? Hey, you in the cannon. Who are you? What are you doing in there? My name's Pe Tepig. I got stuck in the cannon when I was practicing my special move. Now I can't get out. Oh no, we'll get you out. Hold on. Wait, your name's Pe Tepig? Isn't Tepig the one Victini was looking for? So, Victini couldn't find him because he was stuck in there. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> but none of us are tall enough to reach in. How do we get him out? Hey, I know. If we fire the cannon, he should pop right out. <laughs> it's not a bad idea if I do say so myself, you know, except for the fact that he might be blown to pieces. If he's been training, he should be able to handle a little explosion. 
let's go ask someone how to fire the, fire the cannon. Well, I guess that is the uh, the plan here. Oh, you might have some info now, huh? You want to fire the cannon? Just check it. It's really that simple? Oh, oh, oh you're gonna fire me from the cannon? No, no way! Stop! Don't do it! I'm scared. <laughs> I've never heard the cannon talk before. Oh, come on! That's... You seriously thought it was the cannon talking? Come on, Darumaka. And it doesn't sound too happy. Do you really want to fire it? Well, looks like we have no choice. Oh, boy! Brace yourself, Tepig! Well, it seemed to have survived. <laughs> Pikachu, however, seems to have taken more damage. Pikachu is blacked out. You have lost Poké Dollars. So, you're the one who fired me from the cannon. Even though I said not to, I can't believe you did that. Firing a Pokémon from a cannon is really mean. You know what? I'm going to show you exactly what that felt like. And you'll never do anything so reckless again. I challenge you to a battle. Hmm, perhaps I should have did that with Oshawott. Because, you know, it's a fire type, I'm a grass type, Oshawott would have the advantage. Yeah, you see how things are going here. But I don't think I'm going to have too many issues with little Tepig here. Uh, just do your flamethrower, there you go, good boy. And I'll just keep doing that until, you know, you lose. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I, I'm getting a little too shaky, I guess. Mm. Gotta calm my hands down so I don't accidentally do Leaf Tornado. <laughs> Unless I want to do Leaf Tornado, then uh, yeah, like perhaps I'll do a Leaf Tornado here. Just yeah, so like a multi attack. Ow, pain. Super effective. Yeah, it's not gonna destroy Snivy that easily, even though that's super, super effective and whatnot. Alright, one more. One more! Voila! Mm. Hmm? Whoa, what was that? When I was fired from the cannon, I may have come up with an amazing move! Thanks to you guys! What? You were just attacking me and now you're thank- oh, I'll forget it. I'll, I'll take it. Huh? You're not mad anymore? That's right! Now that I think about it, you are trying to help me. Victini was really worried. He asked us to look for you. He did? Oh wow, friends are the best. Victini is always taking care of me. Still, you guys are really tough. I've got it. Team up with me. Let's join the battle tournament. The battle tournament? That sounds great. Let's do it. Tepic was nice enough to invite us, and if we go check it out, maybe the Wish Park crew will be there looking for a strong Pokemon. Come on, Oshawa. I know you really just want to be in the tournament. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's alright. It does sound like fun. How about it, Pikachu? Wanna team up with Tepig and join the battle join the battle tournament? Um Nah Aw, oh, that's too bad. Let me know if you change your mind. I've changed my mind. <laughs> I bet that would have happened if I would have did the same thing back at with Snivy, you know, joining up with Snivy. So you'll join my team? Thanks! Let's go visit Embor! He need his permission to participate in the battle tournament. Woo! Who didn't even give me a choice this time? <laughs> Tepig's tackle is very powerful. Try dashing into a rock and you might be able to break it. Tepig uses fire type moves. Hold then release one to use flamethrower. Shake the Wii Remote to use Heat Crash. So, let's try out our new flaming buddy. The first thing you're going to notice off, off the bat Tepig is really, really slow, even if you upgrade its dash. However, it's much, much more powerful than other Pokemon in the team, so it sort of kind of balances out. Look at this, look at this right here. E. See that? See that? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's, it's moving, it's moving, isn't it? E. Ah! Hmm, how could I get something that looks like a rock to come out of the ground? Maybe an Oshawott move will do the trick. Ha! Mm -hmm. ah! Aren't you an adorable little dwebble? <clears throat> you showed up on nowhere. You need, you need something. I was visualizing a successful battle, but you distracted me. Play with me! And by play, he means battle. 
really slowly. <laughs> Come on, do an attack. I just want to see what you've got. That's it. No, I will not. Oh, your attack is kind of powerful if you're hit by it. But you're too slow to do much of anything. <laughs> I guess that was a sand attack? Sort of. Oh, I lost. Hmm, you're good. Maybe it was a mud slap. This thing still seems to suit me better. Ooh, the webble is my friend. Alright. And now, Crustal has come out. This, uh, this guy appears at a different spot. It's like on one of the higher areas. Like, you can't find him on the lower areas, if I recall correctly. So, don't really even bother. Hey, hey who are you? Hmm. 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 Oh, I, I didn't mean to. Kind of slipped. <laughs> Me. Me. Hmm. You don't seem to want to do much of anything, do you? Do you? Hmm. Hmm. Is it possible to get him now? I don't remember. Oh, by the way, now when you change Pokemon, you can go in a full circle. It's kind of interesting. Yeah! Now... What if I were to say... Nyah! Nope! You aren't budging, are you? You aren't budging, are you? Okay, I'll figure that out later. <laughs> uh, anyway, there is a box right here, but don't break that box. You want to go on the box and go up here. Because there's a vast white quill! Oh yeah! And if you break that box, let's see what's inside, there's that. But you can't get up there now, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of mean that they do that, but if you break the box first like that, just leave the area and come back. The box will, of course, be back. Anyway, let's keep exploring to see who, oh, who we can befriend, like you! Scraggy, out of he anyone! I will be the champion! Hmm. You won't battle me? You won't do anything of the sort? Fine, be that way. <laughs> oh! I'm sorry! I'm so sorry! By the way, did I friend you when I, uh... I didn't think so. Someday I'll succeed, Darwin and E.T. in as a gatekeeper. My big brother says he never wants to be a gatekeeper. I think it's very important, John. That's why I want to train myself. Let's play Chase. Alright. Chase versus Snivy at maximum speed. Oh, this is gonna be a very one-sided affair. Neat. <laughs> it's too bad. Too bad. <laughs> Chase is fun. It's good training, too. It's all upside. Let's play again. Woo! Oh, I love super fast Snivy. Alright, so we got a jack-in-the-box there. Uh, who did we not friend around here? Here's a ball. Yeah! Whoa! I don't know why I did that. I'm just, <laughs> just kind of messing around here. Uh, let's go... Oh, up here. Oh, no! I'm sorry, Primeape. Please forgive me. No, no, no. I want... Actually, I want to talk to you. Yes, yes, talk. Yes. You, what are you after? If it's a fight you want, you've got it. Well... That's what I usually say. But these days, I'm really into running. Hey, you, chase me now. All right. Go, 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 go. It's going up, huh? 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 I'm going up too, then. I think you know which Pokemon you should be picking for chase from now on. <laughs> Thought I was hyper before. But now I'm even hyper uh, Thanks. <laughs> I don't think that's a word. It might be a word. I could be wrong. All right, now let's go up. Oh, 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 Feral Seed. Uh, you're on, you stick around the lower level, don't you? Yeah, I should probably go check you out. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> nope, no Feral Seed, Mr. Berry. Wait, can I? Maybe it's up here. Nah, I didn't think so. Little Feral Seed is pretty hard to find, actually. I kind of like to knock that out now. Uh, oh, oh, there you are. Yes, you aren't that hard to find. This thing fell off the top. I can't get back. All the way up there. I'm going up there anyway, I suppose. Uh, carry me over there, would you? Oh, I guess. 
Thanks, and I forgot to tell you, but if you move too fast, I might explode. That's not a problem, right? That kind of is a problem. It's like you're a time bomb. Uh, all right, guess I gotta go slow enough. Oh boy, this is uh, this is gonna be a fun trip, isn't it? <laughs> Cause I can't like throw you around, can I? Just out of curiosity. Nope. Wait, I, I, maybe I can. Well, it doesn't really help. I do throw you around, but maybe it's only when I knock into you you'll explode. Oh, jeez. So, uh, how's the weather? Is it pretty nice where you are? It's been kind of hot here. It's been like the 80s. I know, I know, I'm trying. It's been the... In the 80s, really humid. A lot of bad storms for some reason. Wait, why? Why? No, no, don't, don't explode. Don't explode. Oh! It's okay, it's okay. I've got you. There's no no need to panic. No need to worry. I'm just gonna just gonna take you up here nice and gentle. Please, primate, don't give me issues. Okay, that works. <laughs> okay, now from here, there's a couple. Uh, of paths. I think I want to go to the left once I get to the end of the bridge. I just wanted to check it when I got to the center there because yeah this is really slow and I don't want to take a route that I don't have to take if at all possible so yeah. <laughs> Alright there's the chest that we've seen. I can get that chest when I get up there actually. I know, I know, I, I wish I was faster, but just how things go, I suppose. Alright, now any boulder that you see with that symbol, you can break with Tepig! And now you know how to get into those special spots. Yeah! That I couldn't have, I mean, I didn't have access to before. Maybe Tepig, maybe, yeah, I think Tepig is a little faster. Maybe. Because, probably because it's stronger. So maybe that's the best use for Tepig, is to use it to break stuff and to carry stuff. Here, thanks to you, I was able to come back. It was fun seeing different scenery than usual. Woo! It looks like you're pretty mobile on your own, so... See ya! Yeah, you do seem pretty mobile on your own. Did you just walk yourself right off the cliff on your own? Like, that, that seems kind of counterproductive, since you wanted to come up here and... Oh, forget it. Anyway, jump down here. Yeah, off that crack. And you'll come across one of these special treasure chests! Containing 15 Everflames. You're gonna need a bunch of those for Poke uh, Pokemon in a little bit uh, further area. Um, there's also this right here. Yeah, one of these mood stations, I guess you could say. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, every... By the way, that flame attack that I'm doing there happens when you press the one button to do a dash attack. Yep, see that? So it's it's like a little bit of a stall to do that move, but it's it's also like its way of attacking, like how it starts out. Um, anyway, let's go up here. I want hero scars. Why do you want hero scars? Uh, I'd rather not. <laughs> I don't really need the berries, in all honesty. Uh, let's see here. Hmm? Hey, let's play. Nah, that's okay. Alright, I understand. Please come again. Uh, here's a, a switch for Tepig. Oh, there we go. Will anyone pass without permission from Embor? Despite appearances, a gatekeeper has quite a nerve-wracking job. Have you seen Darmanitian? No, uh, I'm not talking about me. There's another gatekeeper, but he is quite free-spirited. If you see him, tell him to come back. Alright. So this must be the point when I can befriend the other one. So I'm gonna go up here actually. This isn't where it is, but oh, hey, hey! I should I should really switch. <laughs> it, it it it's just so. I'll, no, I I won't switch actually. Well, I already switched, but I mean I, I didn't really show the abilities of uh, my piggy friend here. I like to go for a walk while carrying my friends. Makes my legs strong, but big rocks are blocking my usual path. And I need help. If someone crashed into them. I think they might break. So he wants me to break out all of these, all around the top path here, if at all possible. And uh, you're really slow. <laughs> uh, there's a drift blim station up there, as you already seen. I'm looking for a um, ledge, like. Um, 
Uh, I'm gonna go around and break the boulders, but what I'm looking for is the ledge to drop off of to get the vast white quill we seen when we came to this area. Uh, down there is where the chest was. Uh, there's the bridge. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think, oh, okay, I think... No, this isn't it. Nah! There's a vast white quill up there. Uh, that's not the one I'm looking for. <laughs> not gonna complain though, I'm gonna collect all the vast white quills in the game, so... Grab it while you're here. Alright, I'm gonna go across here... Chili crystals, how do they not melt around here? Did I get all the boulders? Did I? Did I? Did I? Is that you who cleared the rocks out of my walking path? No, I can have a relaxing walk, thank you. Yeah! Alright, Crustle is befriended. Um, now I gotta figure out where the, uh, wait, 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 is it? Um, I'm, maybe, maybe I don't have access to that path yet. See, there's a, a there's a path that leads over to the cliff side, and it was on one of the higher routes, I thought. Um, yeah, maybe I just don't have access to it yet. Uh, maybe I'll just save that for later and hop on down to, uh, uh, whoop. that could have been dangerous. <laughs> I should say that could have been deadly or something, something that would be painful. There we go, that would work. Hey, hey, how's it going? Hey, Umbor, I'm teaming up with these guys. We're going to be in the battle tournament. That's okay, right? Oh, hello, Tepig. Glad to see you found a team. But you need more than just teammates to join the tournament. There are two additional conditions. First, one member of your team will smash the rock over there. Where is the rock? Okay. I think we know how to smash that rock. Leave it to me. When I was fired from the cannon, I had an idea for an awesome move. You were talking about... The move that is like a ground pound when you shake the Wii Remote? Well done, Tepig. You've become much stronger. This is the second condition. Go to the cave and bring back the Bravery Beard. You reach the cave by being fired from the cannon. Uh oh! Huh? The cannon? Firing Pokemon from a cannon is crazy talk. What? You, you're the one that suggested it. Oh, so I'm the one being fired from the cannon. It's okay. When it's you, well, whatever. Alright, to the cave. So we gotta go to the cannon, to go to the cave and bring back a, a bravery beard. <laughs> That's kind of a silly name for it. So, take this, what are you, who are you attacking? You, looks like you're not attacking anyone, it looks like you're just attacking me off. Anyway, let's go and use the cannon in the next part. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 I forgot about something. Forgot to do this. Hey, hey, someone's looking for you. Ah, that dumb red tin. He left his post again. Yeah, yeah. Try giving him a honey jar. He loves honey, so he might wake up. All right, so I definitely have honey jars. Here's a honey jar. Mm oh. Huh. Mm hmm. Do you smell a honey jar? This sweet smell. It's honey. Do you have a honey jar? Give it to me. Okay. Oh! Why? Why are we in a battle? You said you want a honey jar. I was more than willing to give you a honey jar. Whoa. Well, it has an effect. What are you talking about? Don't give me that. What you got? What you got? What is that? Flame charge? Oh, jeez. How far away are we from... The other battlefield. Oh, geez, we kind of. Oh, wow. Oh, you're jumping down there now, huh? 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 I can deal with that. I can take you on wherever you go. Yeah, we're all the way back at the beginning of the area. <laughs> that is a sort of shortcut back here if you need that for some reason, but um, it's very uncommon to actually end up fighting, you know, from one area to another. Hmm. <laughs> You are just a terrible battler. <laughs> yeah, I would. I was going to um, uh, with Darmatian here. Um, 
I, I was going to do it in this part, but I completely forgot about it and I looked at the part and I was like, oh no! Oh no, let's let's go record it. <laughs> so here I am. Just gotta befriend these guys before the part is over for the sake of organization, if at all possible. Got it? Good. Alright, we got it. <laughs> Woo! And please teleport me back over to where we were. That would speed things along greatly. Thank you! Oh, huh? Did the Darman and Manitian who was washing the gate want me to come back? He's too serious. Well, at least I had a nice nap. Okay, I'll go back. <laughs> there we go. You're welcome! There we go! Got them as my friends. Yo! Um, no. I'm actually gonna end off the part now. <laughs> like, officially. So I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when we go get fire from the Cannon of Doom. Even though a tepic seemed, seemed pretty funny from that. Anyway, ta -da -da! <laughs> What the heck is this? A tanagram puzzle? Make a perfect square, and I'll let you out. Well, okay, let's see if I can figure this out here. <laughs> It'll take you hours to figure this one out. Oh no. I know my tanagram puzzles. Besides, I really want meatloaf. That is my biggest motivation. Hmm. <laughs> Give up yet? No, never. Meatloaf. Hmm. Think I've got this. Think I've got it. Wait, what? How did you figure that out so fast? I. Okay, let me out. Food! No, that, that was too easy. I did your puzzle. Let me out. There's meatloaf with my name on it. No. Just let me think of something else. No, meatloaf now. Meatloaf. 